I want to show you today the four banks that I use that make me do my online transaction easily from Nigeria. You will know already that if you live in Nigeria, you can't just buy things online with your normal card, meaning your normal Visa card and MasterCards in Naira. You cannot transact with that in dollars. But if you want to make money online, then sometimes you have to buy some things online. At least I'm aware you should buy a website, you should buy a domain name. Sometimes you want to buy some tools. But how do you do this? That's why I'm here to show you the four cards you can use that can let you do these transactions from the country without going through any back channel. Alright, let's get things started. The first one is Gray.co. Gray.co can be open for individuals or for a business and it's a banking service for digital nomads, meaning those people that work online. And you can start it online for free. Free USD, Great Britain Pounds, Euro account for all international transactions. Now, for these accounts, they won't give you the USD account because I think there's a little limitation on that. But you can always convert from Great Britain to dollar, whatever you like, you can convert. Now, let me log into my account. And majorly, I use this to always confirm the transactions, you know, in my country. For example, if I have some dollars I want to change to Naira, before I go to the black market, I just check it on here to see how much is it. As of today, one dollar is equal to 994 Naira on this particular platform. So if you want to learn how to open it and how to get your accounts approved by Gray, I'll leave in the description below the full tutorial so you can take that and you get things started. That's my number one. My number two, it's widely acceptable, and I'll tell you the advantages and the disadvantages. It's called Payoneer. Payoneer.com is the business payment for today's global economy. This account has been extremely useful for me for years, and I use it. And Payoneer can help you retrieve money across platforms like Fiverr.com, like Upwork.com. You can hand your money through that and they will allow you to transfer your money directly into your bank. For example, if I sign into my account, it's going to be obvious that this account is actually very, very valuable. The only downside that I see here on Payoneer is the fact that if you use it on Amazon, like your Amazon Kindle publishing books and Amazon in general, there's a huge possibility that Amazon is going to ban you when you do this. And the reason for that is there is no track of tax in Nigeria. So when you use platforms like Payoneer to retrieve your money on Amazon, they will clamp down on you whether you like it or not. But the beautiful thing is you can receive their card. They have a card. Look at this, Payoneer cards. If you click on that, you can request for your card and use it for buying things online and every other thing is there. Then it tells you to order the card, receive at least $100 or equivalent in your account in the past six months. So if you use this on any freelancing website or anywhere and you receive $100, yes, you can use this account to buy anything in the world when you pick up their card. Now, you might be saying, what if I didn't make anything online via this? Can someone just send me money randomly on here? Yes, you can use this account to withdraw money from personal friends that are not marketplaces. For example, you can see here, get paid. When I click on that, you can request for a payment from anyone anywhere all over the world and they'll be able to credit you. The only downside is most times you should have used your account to a level that you have made some money before they will allow you my account is quite old so and i know that there are some metrics you have to meet before this can be done but it's a powerful way you can use to buy things online in dollars from anywhere in nigeria and even those countries that are banned but this is the second one now let's move to the third one this is by far my favorite in nigeria although we use a little bit of technique to do it and it's called PayPal. I know for most of us that have been online for a long time, you are going to say PayPal is not in Nigeria. Yes, it's not in Nigeria, but you can open a PayPal account that is valid in Nigeria. And how do you do this? Let me show you. If I go to PayPal now, by the way, if you live in Nigeria, you're going to have the PayPal persona. You can see persona here. That's what you have. So if you open yours in Nigeria, you'll be able to only send money out to buy something i hope you understand that's legit in nigeria if all your interest is to just use your paypal account to buy things online 
absolutely you can buy with your account with your bank account because you're going to link your account to it your account i'll tell you how you the card that you link because you can't link your naira card to your paypal account it will not allow okay but i'll tell you before i finish this video the exact one you should be linking but what happens is if you want to use paypal itself which can send money and withdraw money you have to go for business and before i got to this particular page if you just type paypal.com in nigeria you will not be able to see these this is what i'm talking about i just type this on another browser and you can see here it only has this persona you won't have the business to it but then if i go here you can see the business you can see partners and developers the way i got to this is by using paypal.com slash is which is like iceland it makes it look like you're in another country okay and then when that is done it's going to give you the business end of it so you click on sign up and then you follow the prompt till you finish registration i'll leave in the description below and also pin to the comment the particular tutorial that allows you to open paypal account in nigeria and you can use it permanently to withdraw money and also to send money out whichever one you want so let me log into my account now and show you because there's a little bit of caveat here as well even when you open there are certain things you have to do to make sure it's functional and that you can use and this is my account which i opened using the same thing and this is all you have to do you can send money out you can withdraw money and if i scroll you see things i'm buying now i get paid you know everything is just here and that's it but remember i said there's a little caveat here you see when you open through these metrics and i go to account settings i cannot just withdraw any amount of money i like or any how i want it there are little restrictions because here i cannot verify you know i opened with iceland or maybe you open with united arab emirates you can't have their id card in your name so you cannot really verify the account they will just allow you to use it it's more like savings account where you really don't have to put 10 million naira inside but it will allow you as a student account to use maybe 500,000, you know that's just the way it is and if i go here to my account you can see i can view what limits i have and majorly the limit is that you cannot withdraw more than three thousand seven hundred dollars in the whole 365 days that is the only limit but then it will allow you to withdraw your money and send your money out provided large volumes are not popping into it okay now let's go to the ones that i use physically here that are physical banks in nigeria i'm going to tell you two and i would explain how things are done with them the first one is guarantee trust bank now i use gtb and they have a dollar account where you can just register with them provided you have an account and you can transact all over the world using that dollar card not a, your regular naira card they give you a special card from gtb and that's the one you can use it works perfectly just like your regular card then to load it is where the issue is because most people are going to say how do i load it because you might not be able to make direct dollar into your account for me i i do a lot of youtube and blogging and they pay me directly to my gtb so i always have like dollars in my dollar account i just don't need to do anything i just link my dollar account to my dollar card simple i can buy anything i want at any time but if you don't have dollars in your dumb account you can just go to any aboki you go with naira they give you dollars and then you do the transaction as simple and also you can use this bank if gtb is not around you or if you practically prefer another bank which is my best of the best the reason why i say this is best is because you don't need to open an account in this bank before you have access to this particular card what bank am i talking about united bank of africa uba uba has what is called a prepaid card which allows you to buy anything online across the whole world it works perfectly provided you're going to spend dollars uba will allow you to do this and to do this is just simple you don't need a uba account or you have to open one you just go there and ask them you want to open the prepaid card and they allow you open you go with your driver's license any form of identification anyway and then address verification which is probably nepa bill or phcn bill okay and then when you have that you also go physically with ten dollar they don't allow you to do transfers you must go with ten dollar fiscal note so you have to change that while you're going and then maybe two passports and you are good to go they don't ask for references they don't ask for anything they're going to open the prepaid card for you 
and then you can start activating because you have to go to the atm and activate it's just like normal cards and then you can buy anything online but what is the deal of you spending dollars online instead of making i prefer to make dollars before i spend dollars if you are interested in making dollars the next video that is popping out now will help you make dollars starting from now click on that video and let's go